Bill, how are you, mate? I'm very well, thanks, pal. You? Excellent. Not bad at all, thank you. Um, right, we're going to play teammates. So, who do you think is the best player at Sheffield United? Uh, the best player for me would have to be John Fleck. Um, I'd have him in, if we were doing a five-a-side tournament, he'd be my first pick. He always seems to be on the winning team. He trains the way he plays, like every professional should, but um, some days it is hard to, you know, play like you, train like you play, but he's constant every day he's um he's one of the best trainers uh with his with the effort he puts in and and the talent he's got the ability and um just some of the things he does in training um we had a training game just before this pandemic started and he was uh he was unplayable it was um it was unreal um he stood out by a mile and he's he's my choice for best player at the club fair enough um who's the biggest joker who's always making the jokes in the change room uh, that's another easy one, uh, Chris Basham. Uh, I think everybody <laughs> would, everybody would say Chris Basham. His uh, his accent helps, um, his Geordie accent, but um, his one-liners, you know, if, whether it's in the changing room on a match day at the training ground, or whether it's having a beer in his in his downtime, he's he's always the one who's making people laugh. So definitely Chris Basham. Absolutely. Who's Mr. Vane? Who's always in front of the mirror doing the barnet and trying to look good? Um, uh, I don't know. There's a few sneaky ones. We've got quite a few mirrors in the in the changing room at the training ground now. But um, <laughs> Dean Henderson likes to look in the mirror. Um, Lee Mooset, maybe he's a sneaky one. He, he likes to stay till the, till the end of uh, training when everybody's gone and has his own music on and has a little dance and you catch him out sometimes. But uh, there's quite a, quite a few lads who who like to take care of himself. But um, no, there's, uh, I'd probably go with Dean Henderson. Fair enough. Who's the hard nut? Who's double hard? Hard nut? Oh, um, I don't know. There's, again, there's a few people who think that think they're hard. But, um, oh, hard <laughs> nut. Um, I'd say Jack O'Connell. He's not nice when you come on the end of a tackle from him. Um, yeah. We call him the bear or, <laughs> or pancake because he flattens everyone. Um, there's just a few, <laughs> few names to... Uh, for Jack, but he, yeah, he's um, he's somebody who, you know, he, the fans say he had bricks. That's his song as well. But no, he's a he's a tough fella and a, a great defender to have at the club. I'd probably go for Jack O'Connell. Who wears rascal clothes? Yeah, <laughs> I don't care. I don't care if they are um, a lot of money. Uh, some of the outfits he comes in, Ollie McBurney is. They are. I don't know whether he does it to make us laugh or. But I actually, don't <laughs> think he does. It can be. Freezing minus two outside, and he'll come in a basketball t shirt, uh, basketball vest with shorts on, and uh, a pair of Gucci trainers, and a, probably a, a fishing fishing hat or something like that. Um, but he's, he's, he's one of a kind, he's a free spirit, if you like, and he, he doesn't really care what people think. He, he's his own person, and um, again, he's, uh, he's good to have in the change room. Who's the biggest moaner? Uh, Christy Basham's up there. Yeah. <laughs> But um, uh, I can have a moan up sometimes um, for the right reasons. Who's the biggest moaner? Um, do you know what? That's a tough one. I'm trying to think now who sticks out. We all have his moan at, at time, but we've been doing so well uh, this season and the last few seasons that we don't have much to moan about. But I'd probably go with Chrissy Basham again. Um, you know... It, <laughs> But he disguises it well because he's, he's so funny and he, he changes it onto somebody else. But I'd probably go bash again. He won't mind me saying that. He likes a good morning for the right Fair reasons. Enough. Who's the best dancer? Who's pulling out the shapes? Uh, yeah, we're not really a team who believes in all the dancing and stuff like that. But um, it's Chris, Chris, me, Wilde that, that, sure. Chris Wilde doesn't let it happen, no? No, I'd... I think Moose has got moves, but he's not. He's, he's a little bit shy, so he only does it in private. Um, again, Chris Basham. I, I don't know whether they're good moves or, but they're hilarious. Some of the some of the dance moves he's got. Um, just the way just the way he holds himself, his his body. Um, you know, he's so Stiffer. tall and thin, and yeah, yeah, he's a bit <laughs> like that. Yeah, he's a. Uh, 
Uh, I'd probably go for, for Moose. Um, he has got moves in the locker. He just doesn't like to show them in front of the lads. Uh, who's got uh, who's got a lovely voice? Who likes to sing? Um, lovely voice. Again, I think for a footballer, it's not something you really want to be um, doing in the changing room. But I'd probably go Ben Osborne. He's pretty good with the guitar as well. He's a... Uh, initiation song when he first signed uh he made it up himself his own words and um wow yeah it was it was pretty good actually and he's got um a decent voice on him so i'll probably go ben osborne who gets fined the most who's always late <sighs> no doubt about this one least moves it he <laughs> might be the last out of the change room but he's last in as well he's always giving money to uh, the fine master who's bash um yeah, he's uh, he's got the fastest car at the club, but I don't know whether he well he certainly didn't drive it slow, but um, he he just sets off too too um, too late. He lives near me, and I'm always in on time. I think I've been late once in the last four years, but you know you can take once or twice. But he's he's late quite a lot, and but fair play to him, he, he pays his fines, so he must be happy happy for what he's doing. Bill, thank you so much for your time, mate, and I uh, hope to see you in the pitch soon. No problem. Thanks a lot, Tubes. Cheers.